Hey guys, this is Guns for Hire with Next Gen Tactics. Ah, not really. <laughs> I'm not going to do these very often, okay? But uh, uh, I, I wanted to talk about a couple of things that don't don't have anything to do with gaming, okay? No, no, no games right now. Um, I, I've been asked a, a lot of different questions, things that uh, I'm <laughs> I'm really um, uh, amazed uh, that everybody's taking the time to ask me so many questions. But it, here's the thing, okay? Um, I want to talk about. Uh, First of all, in, in one of my other videos, I talked about the end. Um, you can find me anywhere, uh, just about anywhere, online. Um, you know, Xbox, PlayStation, uh, the Wii. I know, crazy, I know. Um, you know, Steam, uh, Xfire, Gmail, you, you, you know, Yahoo, YouTube. All of these places. Okay, my my moniker is exactly the same. Uh, it is Anakin with four ends on the end. On the end, I know technically <laughs> there's five ends. I know you guys have pointed that out, but anyway, it's a uh, A N A K I N N N N. Okay, um, there is one little asterisk next to that, uh, and the problem is Steam um, somehow got my account goofed up at one point. I, I installed a new game, uh, my account wouldn't you know reset or whatever. I, I don't know what happened, and I had to make a temporary account. So don't laugh. Uh, my Steam account has one more in on the end. <laughs> I know. Let, let me just let me just spell that out for you one more time, just in case you don't get it. It's A N A K I N N N N N. Eh? Five ins on the end. Okay, that, that's for that's for my PC friends. Okay, that's uh, my Steam account. I, I don't know what's going on. I have asked Steam to try to fix it. Uh, if anybody out there from Steam uh, is listening, please fix my account. Put back the four ends instead of five. I've asked you a hundred times, and they, they, you guys just won't do it for me. I don't, I don't understand. Anyway, that's my only account almost in the entire world that is an Anakin with four ends. So um, one other thing I want to talk about very, very, very quickly, okay? Uh, everybody asks me what I do for my gaming setup and my gaming rig and, you know, all this, this other stuff, Okay. Uh, I am using a hop hog, uh, and that is the way you say it, hop hog, um, ding, the more you know, um, HD PVR, okay, that is the, basically, pretty much it seems like the um, overall choice for all the uh, the gaming commentators out there. Uh, I did a ton of research uh, early on here, uh, before I ever became a director, I just kind of looked and, 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 you know, what is everybody doing out there? And, uh, and that was the overwhelming majority. It seems like everybody's doing that. The one caveat to that thing, you know, something that to at least, if you ever want to get into it, it doesn't do HDMI. And, and I'm assuming uh, that there's some kind of problem where, you know, it has to do with the HDCP technology, which is where, you know, there's, there's some kind of copyright uh, issue where, you know, it has to, has to decode that or whatever when it goes in. You know, don't, don't get me talking about that. But anyway, um, I, I believe that that's probably why they went with straight analog inputs. It is component in, it's got the 5.1 digital, digital uh, uh, optical uh, <clears throat> input, sorry, for the, um, uh, for the audio. Really good stuff, okay? I, I really like it. Uh, the other option out there is the Dazzle HD. Uh, that seems like a pretty good option for a lot of people who just want to kind of get into it. It's fairly inexpensive, but I want to explain the difference in those two things because a lot of people are asking me about this, okay? And I don't know if anyone's really ever gone, gone over it very well. The HD PVR from Hop Hog is the encoder. It's a hardware encoder, okay? It, it does, you know, it, it does everything in the box. Uh, and then basically transfers that encoded video to your hard drive. So your PC is not really doing any work. You can have a, a, an older computer, three, four, five years old even, and plug in an HD PVR to it, and you can pretty much work with HD video coming in as long as your hard drive can run it fast enough, which, you know, any, any hard drive from the last five years or so and, and even further back will obviously do that with no problem. Um, the HD Dazzle, the difference is, is you have to have a very powerful PC, uh, you know, something that can actually do the encoding in real time on the fly. Because the difference between the HD PVR and the Dazzle HD is that the Dazzle HD is is actually a, a a transport method. It's getting the video into your computer, but your computer's having to do the actual real time encoding with the software from the Dazzle. So those are kind of the the different things. So. You know, a lot of people are like, oh, my God, I don't want to pay for the HD, you know, PVR. It's expensive. 
well, you're going to pay for it one way or another to be able to do this whole like director thing. You know, you're going to have to have a really nice computer, uh, and, and then you're going to you know cheap out and get the HD Dazzle, which is fine if you happen to have an awesome computer. If you don't have an awesome computer, um, the HD PVR is definitely the way to go. I actually try to combine both worlds because you know if you have seen some of my wacky stuff I do. Uh, my special effects uh, take up a lot of processing power, and of course the rendering time is is uh, kind of crazy. So I actually keep a, a, a nice gaming rig and a, a high end, uh, you know, a high end unit uh, to go along with my HD PVR. Um, one of the other uh, other things I, I keep getting asked, you know, is 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 I'm, am I real? You know, I, I mentioned that in my last video. Here I am. I'm Anakin. Uh, not guns for hire, even though we sort of look alike. Look, look at me, huh? Huh? craziness. Anyway, um, the last thing I want to say is that, uh, yes, I play on PlayStation. I have a PS3. Uh, I get about uh, 2,000 comments, uh, uh, you know, a, a day, it seems, although that's an exaggeration. You know, I, I get like two, I guess. But anyway, uh, a lot of people ask me, uh, do I play on PS3? I, I do. Uh, I, I have played all the Uncharted's. I have Rock Band 3 and a library of almost 1,000 songs in my Rock Band setup. Uh, I have a, a bunch of other very, very cool uh, uh, games, Kill Zone, and uh, some of the other stuff, Metal Gear, you know, all that for the PS3. I don't have Black Ops on the PS3. I opted for Black Ops on my Xbox because that's where most of my friends are. Uh, I play with a lot of my, uh, uh, you know, really, really close friends on the Xbox. Uh, it's not that I didn't want to buy it for the PS3, it's just I, I opted for one or the other. So uh, if someone wants to uh, send me a, a copy of Black Ops for the PS3, because everybody keeps asking me to play with them, uh, I will gladly accept it and I will split my time between the Xbox and the PS3. But at this point, uh, Black Ops is a great game, but um, you know, dropping an extra $65 after tax, 65 American dollars for... Um, uh, for all of you out there, you know that's that's a chunk of change, you know. And I I'm doing all this director stuff, and I'm I'm having a good time with it. But uh, I have made zero dollars, zero zero pennies. Let's say uh, I have not gotten anything financially back from this crazy adventure. So um, at this point, honestly, you know I've got uh, quite a bit of time and money invested in this whole thing, and I'm really having a good time. You guys make it extremely worth it. But right now, uh, I, I keep getting asked, will you play Black Ops with me on, on PC? Will you play it with me on the PS3? Uh, you know, I will gladly do it if somebody will finance my, uh, it, you know, games for those two platforms. And I will gladly uh, install those immediately, get them running, and jump on in and, and start playing and, and run some open channels over there on those other platforms. But for right now, the Xbox is really all I have uh, because of the, the, you know, the investment I put in that one. Um, you know, all the other platforms are there and, and ready to go, but no Black Ops. So, anyway, just wanted to clear that up as well. Last thing is, is uh, I want to just say thanks again for uh, all the uh, subscriptions to my channel. You know, I, I can't tell you guys enough how, I, I, how much I really appreciate it. And the, in all of these comments, I spend so much time uh, responding to comments. You know, I, I have sad news, gang. You know, it is, as my channel grows... I don't know, I really don't know how long I'm going to be able to continue responding to every single uh, comment. You know, maybe what I'll do is um, I may trim back and, and uh, you know, respond to a lot of comments uh, over at the NGT Games channel, over at, uh, uh, you know, my, my YouTube front page area there. And what I'll do for a long time is respond to every comment on my videos on my channel because you know that's the that's the real core group there. I want you guys to know that I'm I, I always read every comment regardless. Okay, every single comment. But as as the channel grows and as these comments just flood in, uh, I, I do have a, a wife, a house, a normal day job, an evening job that I do. Uh, you know, after work from time to time when people need my help on computers and various other things. Uh, I have two golden retrievers, three cats and um, four consoles and eight computers. A lot of things uh, take up my time and I am trying to balance it all and the comments are probably the the uh, worst thing right now that I'm I'm having chew up my time. So I've got to find a way to balance all this and, and I'm telling you I read every comment. Uh, probably here in the next few weeks you're gonna start seeing me skip a few comments and I'm hoping to clear some of these comments up right now that I get a lot of 
Uh, yes, I play on the PS3. That is one I swear I get asked more than anything. And also, you know, a lot of people ask me what my, my game, uh, gamer tag is or my uh, moniker is on all these other platforms. And like I said, it is Anakin. A-N-A-K-I-N-N-N-N. -N -N -N. Um, so, anyway, uh, once again, last thing I want to say, thank you very much to Guns for Hire and Spider by Ann Bentley over at uh, Next Gen Tactics. These guys have opened up this door of opportunity for me, and let me tell you, I couldn't get through the door fast enough. Uh, you guys are making all of this worth it, and I really do appreciate it. And uh, we're about to start some open lobbies tonight. It's uh, Sunday night, uh, the weekend before Christmas, and um, this week is going to be a little crazy for me. Last thing I want to say, too, uh, I I'm going to get some open lobbies going here in just a few minutes. Jump on Xbox. You guys join me. Um, my wife and I are expecting twins, as I've mentioned in a couple of my videos. She is absolutely wonderful, but, you know, there are times when she walks in the room and stares at me and goes, Will you help me? My stomach is huge. And I'm like, okay, all right, I'm, I'm, I'm coming, I'm coming. So um, I, I, <laughs> this is going to happen uh, very soon for us. I've got to make time for that. Um, I am not by any means going to disappear or give up my channel or anything like that. I will just not be posting videos and hosting lobbies every single day. They will continue. Um, obviously, for the first couple of weeks that the, uh, the twins get here, I don't have any children right now. These are the first for us. Um, when they arrive, obviously I'm going to be a little out of pocket <laughs> for the first couple of weeks at least. Um, I will make appearances. I will have some games put up. Uh, it, I, I may not be able to reply to my comments like I normally do, but you will definitely see my presence around and I will get back in the groove as soon as possible uh, and, and I will ramp everything back up as soon as those kids get here. Uh, by the way, it is a boy and a girl. Uh, Tracer and Leela are their names. I've been asked that quite a bit as well, and you know what? Uh, even for showing interest, I can't, I, I can't even begin to tell you guys how sincerely uh, uh, impressed I am that you guys take the time to ask me about that, and, and it, really, uh, it really means a lot to me. So anyway, thanks again for all the subscriptions. You guys are all my friends. I really do appreciate it, and um, come and join me in my game lobby. We're going to get one started in just a few minutes. Thanks a lot. Bye-bye. Hey guys, we're on Facebook. Check the description of this video for the link to our new Facebook application. Subscribe and get our latest video updates posted right on the wall on your own Facebook page.